Over the course of the past few months, I've noticed that these conundrum drill bit sharpeners have become readily available. Several of the big box stores sell these, such as Walmart and Harbor Freight, and you can also purchase them online at Amazon and eBay. They're relatively inexpensive, ranging in price from around six to eight dollars. I bought this one on eBay for seven dollars and that included shipping. One of the first things I was interested in was the angle at which they sharpen drill bits. Here is a drill bit that I purchased from a big box store and it's supposed to be for general drilling and the angle is 124 degrees and when I compare that to the angle of this drill bit sharpener I see that it is about slightly less maybe 121 degrees that indicates that this drill sharp drill bit sharpener is for general cutting of most woods and some soft metal but most likely wouldn't be available wouldn't be appropriate for hardened steel here is a close up of a new drill showing the angle and the same drill compared to the sharpener. Here is a drill bit that I used to drill some very hard steel. The only thing I accomplished was flattening the drill bit. I'm going to use this drill bit on the conundrum drill bit sharpener. My first attempt at sharpening a drill bit with this grinder was not successful. What I done was simply insert the drill bit, sharpen the leading edge, flipped it over, sharpen the leading edge on the other side. And when I attempted to drill, it didn't work. And then by looking at a larger drill, I discovered the reason why. If you look carefully, the, the cutting edge is higher than the trailing edge. So the drill bit has to be sharpened at an angle. And in order to achieve this, it is necessary to insert the drill bit and then turn it counterclockwise and sharpen it at an angle. And it must be done the same thing on the other side. It must be turned counterclockwise and pushed into the drill to get that angle. As illustrated, the drill bit cut with the angle does a superior job. Here is the drill bit before sharpening, and here is the same drill bit after sharpening. Here are my conclusions after using this sharpener. These sharpeners are readily available. They're inexpensive. They're easy to use after you learn the technique. And they perform well for the average do-it-yourselfer. The cons for these drill bits are they are not for the construction or professional trades. They are for the typical do-it-yourselfer, and they are not for cutting hard steel.